down on this game. Hey, what's up, Missy? Because at the moment, in my head, I'm basically thinking this is just a Souls game with a different set of slightly altered controls. This place is huge. <laughs> I mean, I've not played much of this so far, but I have a feeling I'm definitely going to like this. Oh, I see. Okay. Again, I think I'm just getting ahead of myself here. I'll just take my time and see how we get on. Look at the amount of detail here. Fuck. I've not noticed that. Look at the length of their arms, Jesus. Are these guys infected or are they turning or... Oh, oh shit! I kind of want to try this charged attack. Nice. Hey, what's up, Nyman? It's only taken me about three years, but I finally got round to it. It's finally happening. <laughs> Honestly, I feel like a fucking kid in a candy shop. I'm actually excited to play a game for the first time in ages. Ooh, let's just chill. Let's all relax. Slow and steady wins the race. No rush. I can't get over how good this game looks, though. God, the amount of detail. So I'm assuming, and this is probably me again getting way too far ahead of myself, I'm assuming I've woken up in the clinic after like a disease has passed through here? Am I one of the few hunters alive? This lamp now transports you back to the hunter's dream. Upon death, you will awaken at this lamp. Right, okay, so it's basically the bonfire. Okay. God, I'm assuming they've tried to keep bodies from turning, seeing as there's about 10 or so padlocks on there. Oh my god, man, this game. <laughs> Look how pretty it is. Shit. Oh man, I'm liking the combat so far as well. Oh, I am liking the combat. Stop. 
smoke weed every day. Missy, thanks for the follow. Oh, unlucky. guys going I'm scared to get too close because I'm assuming I'll probably aggro but see they look human from a distance they definitely look human but they've got really elongated arms let me go back up here Sure, this is the area I would have dropped down from up there. Man. See, I kind of want to concentrate on not dying for the time being, but I can't wait to find out more about this story. What the fuck happened here? Look at the state of this place. Jesus. Is this what the residents would have turned into? I mean, this thing looks like it's got bandages on its head. Please tell me this unlocks from this side. Nope. Okay. Oh, can you not backstab on this game? Brings me back here nice. Oh, look at that damage! Fuck! Jesus! And I don't have any healing items. Go, 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 go. Alrighty then. Fuck. Okay, so I think the area I unlocked has got to be... Yeah, there we go. And I think those are my souls. Nice. to get close. See, I thought... I need to really check the controls. Bear with me, because I thought... Is Square not heal on this game? Do I need to equip a healing item? Quick items, I guess? Invigorates the senses, restoring the larger amount of HP. Um, oh, wow, I've only got one healing item. Fuck. Blood vial acquired from the lady doctor at Iasefka's clinic. This refined blood, highly invigorating, restores a larger amount of HP. This rare blood vial is a product of a slow and careful refining process, likely devised by the doctor herself. Blood that has looked like it's got, you know, no blood cells in it at all. 
Um, if I need anything, I'll ask. I thought I might be able to heal, though. I don't know, maybe I need to, like, unlock a, a flask or something? Oh my fucking good god in heaven. That damage is insane. I'm not going to be able to take this guy down. Holy shit! Oh my good god. Yeah, I'm going to come back to him, I think. <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah, I think I'm going to be coming back to him. Just again, bear with me, guys. Let me just, let me get used to this. Let me get warmed up. Take care, Mason. Bye-bye. Oh, backstabs don't exist on this game. But you can stagger enemies by hitting them with a charged R2. Ah, sweet. Oh my god, this axe feels so good to use. Nice. I just want to watch these guys just to see where they go. I don't know, maybe if you don't. Oh, shit. Oh my good god. Oh! You little fucker! Oh. Hey, what's up, skeleton? Yeah, go for it, Emma. Go for it. I'm not going to stop you. You little fuck. I really like the way where you've got a little bit of time, if you've been hit, to, you know, hit the enemy back and get a little bit of your health back. I really, really do like that. I'm kind of playing a bit like a pussy, because I don't know where I'm going. Oh, shit. Yeah, I feel like I'm playing like a bit of a pussy. Nice. And I've got to say, Nyman, I think you were right when you said, you know, I'll fit right in with this game. This just kind of feels natural to me without having to use um, any shields or anything like that. Look at the size of some of these beasts. I want to go and try all of these doors, but I'm sure they're all going to be locked. I'm just scared I might miss something. But please, don't tell me. At least not on this playthrough. Not yet.
Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. I really need to find out how the fuck you heal. It's definitely not square. Triangle, okay. I think that might take a little bit just to get used to. Right, let's go and get the guy with the gun. Nice. Oh! <laughs> Shit, not good, not good. I think I've bitten off a little bit more than I could chew here. Holy fuck! Oh god, oh god, the dogs. Okay. Let's go and take care of all of these guys up here. Can you do a running charged R2 attack? No. I know I'm doing a really shit job on the first time, Martinez, but honestly, I am fucking speechless. It, it feels so weird to be playing this. I know it's been out for a long, long time, but... Oh, man. I just, I can't get over how nice it looks. Oh, you can do plunge attacks as well. Nice. Beautiful looking game. Now, whether you can explore all of this is another question, but. Jesus. I feel like I should be using the gun, or at least I should have tried the gun by now, but... Smoke weed every day! Thanks for the follow, Hungry. See, I... I'm assuming that you have to parry with the gun, but I've never really parried in the Souls game, so... I guess I could always give it a shot if I'm shit with it. You know, just stick to, uh, two-handedness. Bloodstone shard. I'm gonna read the descriptions probably when I get back. Uh, when I level. Can you get down there? Now, someone's got a giggle fit in that gaff. Shit! Okay, I'm not taking any chances here. I am not taking any chances. I've always felt that with the uh, Souls games, to get to know the lore, you really have to talk to every NPC. 
and read near enough every item description. Although, a lot of people seem to hate that. I don't know why. I kind of like it. And I'm guessing, you know, Bloodborne's going to be no different. that might be an NPC to talk to. Nope, never mind. When the hunt began, the healing church abandoned us, blocking the great bridge to the cathedral ward, as they burned all Yarnum to the ground on that moonlit night. Shit, I wonder if I've missed any of these notes. That's sick though, if this game has a couple of these notes scattered about by the people that lived here. Nice little bit of exposition that you don't get in the other Souls games. See, I can hear in the back. Like people whispering, I guess, is the villagers here? Apart from this and Dark Souls 3 Angry Gamer, I've played all of the other Souls games. Oh shit. I don't know if I've got a lot of souls or not. Sorry, I keep calling it souls. It's not souls, is it? It's uh, blood. Blood tinge or something like that. I don't know whether it might be time to go and level here. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I think the more I play this, the more used to the combat I'll get. Just with the... I don't want to call them combos as such, but you know with the charged R2 attack? The more I use it, the more satisfying it feels. Jesus Christ. I've not been wrecked too bad, favourite. Um, I did get done in by the giant with the axe. Um, you know the area where you start off in, in the clinic? There's a big door to the right that you have to unlock from the other side. It's, there's like a giant with a huge axe there. I got killed by him two or three times. So I think, you know, it's it's basically a polite sign saying come back a little bit later on. But it feels like I'm down some, you know, back alley in Victorian days or Victorian times here. I know it's probably a little bit too late now, but for tomorrow, before I start streaming, I'm going to see if I can get another USB stick um, to format and just play all the videos on again. Because like I said before, I haven't seen the trailers. And I kind of wish it worked this time, because I plan to basically watch all of the Bloodborne trailers, excluding gameplay. And then, you know, play this game.
god. It looks like there's so much to explore here. Holy shit. Bad boy. You're a hunter, aren't you? Then, well, do you know of any safe places? I've heard I have. Shutting up indoors isn't always enough. Well, if you once have got off your arse, you wouldn't be in this mess. You're obligated to help me, you hear? So I'm not the only human. Are you gonna tell me you're not? So I'm Right, so as far as I'm aware, I'm just a normal human and there are other humans in this place in Yarnum that, you know, still exist, but they're all holed up in their houses. Um obviously afraid of, you know, getting killed by the beasts or whatever they're called. Talking to. Hey, what's up, Shawnee? Yeah, I should have known. You're good for nothing. No respect for the elderly is what that is. Yeah. That little good you outsiders do. Go on, admit it. You think we're all mad, don't you? Well, go and stop it. I know all this. Okay, clearly she's not interested. I wonder if I might be able to come back? She's asked for a safe space and the only option I got was no. Um, could I take her back to like the mansion where I picked the weapon? Well, that's a safe space. But then again, I got to the mansion by dying. But I should have really read all of the item descriptions and everything. 